Hey everybody, Merry Christmas. Happy Merry Christmas. holidays hey. to you all. Yes. So right now we're going to be making a quick dip. It's called taco salad dip. Have you ever had it? Did you? I have not had this one. I've had variations. There's okay. a little difference on what I've had, but I do like taco stuff. So Me too. And y'all, this is great for your last minute Christmas get togethers. It's great for the Super Bowl party you're going to have. Oh, Super Bowl, Super Bowl, yeah. I forgot that is coming up. It will be in January. Is yeah. it in January? It's in, it's usually uh, close to my birthday, which is in January. Okay. January, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> so anyway, this is a great uh, dip recipe. I serve it with uh, Tostitos or any kind of nacho chips, but you could certainly do it with crackers or something too. But it's so easy. I've been making this as long as I've been married, and we've taken it to so many parties, and everybody gobbles it up. It's really good. Okay, so all you're going to need is you're going to need one can. Debbie's already cut the lid off for me, or pulled the lid off. She's trying to, trying to get a little ahead. <laughs> so um, you're going to do one can of bean dip, and this is just Frito Lay bean dip we have around here. And so I'm gonna layer it on the bottom of my casserole dish. So what size is that dish? Is it eight and a half by 11? Well, I think it is an eight and a half by 11 dish. It's just a red one for Christmas. It's you very know, pretty. We gotta have Christmas dishes. And so I'm just gonna smear it on the bottom. I like that word, smear. smear. I'm gonna smear it. <laughs> I'm gonna smear it on the bottom. I don't know if y'all can see what I'm doing here, but. It's going to be a thin layer of bean dip. I might should have got a smaller one. I'm not sure that's going to be as thick as I like it, but we'll see. Well, you want to do it in a different bowl? Nope, not now. <laughs> you can scrape it off. <laughs> uh, I can lick it off. That's what I'm about to do. It smells so good. Yeah, okay. That <laughs> yeah, that was gross, wasn't it? Okay, so, but yeah, I think this is about right because I normally do do put it in a uh, casserole. Okay, so it's going to be kind of thin layers. Thin layer of bean dip anyway. Which, Which is, works. I mean, I made something last night, and I think we had too much of the bean dip mixture. It well, wasn't think, bean dip. But yeah. I think um, you don't want... Beans are kind of strong flavor. You don't want them overpowering the taco mixture. Yeah. No, so true. maybe that's why it's like that. Okay, I'm going to have to use my little finger. Hands are clean, y'all. Okay, just smear that off there. Now, you can see what I've done. It's just a thin layer, layer of bean dip. Let me wash my hands again. It's got a lot of good, um, a good ingredients in it. So, so it sure is this is a is this a baked recipe? No, nope, no, we don't bake it at all. Okay. Um, okay. Now we're gonna do a half a cup of mayonnaise, and I use the mm. olive oil mayonnaise. I know Debbie hates mayonnaise, y'all. Y'all know that. Deb <laughs> hates mayonnaise. Let ooh. it be known that she will always give me an ooh when I say mayonnaise. It's in something. I don't like to smell it. I don't like, like to look it. at it. She gonna like it anyway. I'll try the dish, but I hate right. the mayonnaise. So half a cup of mayonnaise, eight ounces of sour cream, which is one cup. I'm so I suppose if I were making this and I didn't want to use mayonnaise, I could substitute sour cream, more sour cream for the mayonnaise. What do you think? Is that a possibility? Know. We'll see. We're not gonna we're not gonna judge it till we try it, baby. Okay. You're gonna like okay. it, I promise. You're not gonna <laughs> even know there's mayonnaise in there. Okay, so I'm mixing the sour cream and the mayonnaise <laughs> together. Really good. Now here is what makes it the taco dip. Uh -huh. I've got a package of taco season. Use any brand you want. This is Old El Paso, but you can use any brand, store brand. Flavor God brand, any kind you want. Baby. I have a knife here. My, my hands are weak, y'all. Yeah, do that. That's good. Okay, perfect. All right, so I'm just gonna dump teamwork. this whole teamwork makes the dream work. I'm gonna dump this whole taco seasoning mix into my bowl and mix it. Oh, that smells so good. You know, I had some um, Southwestern seasoning. I mean, that would chef, work. Southwest, yes. If I didn't have the, the taco seasoning. So y'all know Deb sells Pampered Chef. So Pampered Chef has a wonderful Southwestern seasoning yes, and we favorite. use it all the time. Yes. I love it on chicken. It's my fave. Chicken. Um, chicken see. with uh, olive oil and some Southwestern seasoning. Mm -hmm. Cooking skillets. Yeah. Okay, so this is the piece de la resistance. Oh, look at you. I know. <laughs> 
So, um, yeah, so I mix that all together and now I'm simply going to place it on top of the, I'm gonna kind of do it in little increments here so I don't get heavy on one end. Let me bring the camera over a little okay, closer. Okay, the cameraman woman. So we woman. can see up close what you're doing. Okay. This would be great for a family Christmas, finger food um, party or anything. Um, my family loves it. And it seems like it's going to be something really quick, so it'll be quick and easy. Quick and easy oh, and not expensive good. to make either. Oh, that's good. Yeah, so it's not expensive to make. It's looking really great. Mm -hmm. You will like it, I promise. See, you can't even tell there's mayonnaise in well, there. Well, it's the thing with me, it's just in my head. <laughs> well, I shouldn't have let you know. You shouldn't have told me. Well, well that would have been hard to do, Deb. I'm about to <laughs> poke myself with this knife. Okay, so I'm spreading it out. Debbie has chopped me some tomatoes. She has grated some uh, sharp cheddar cheese. Mm -hmm. Nice. Now, if you wanted to, you could add really finely chopped lettuce, but I'm not going to oh, do that. Uh, yeah. I'm not going to do that. Do you want to run in there and get us um, chips out of that chip drawer in the pantry? Because we're going to test it out on camera and see if you like it. I know, I'm brave, y'all. Because you know anything with mayonnaise in it, then you will actually, I don't know if she'll spit it out, but she won't like it. If it, if she don't like it, she don't like it. <laughs> but anyway, okay, now we've got that on top of the bean mixture. We've got your, your um, mayonnaise, sour cream, taco seasoning. Now, you can add any kind of toppings you want. You can add olives, onions, whatever. Jalapenos? Would that be something? You can add jalapenos. Jalapenos. <laughs> How do you say it? Jal jal jalapenos. jalapenos. <laughs> okay, but what I'm going to add first is grated cheddar. And I'm not going to add a ton of it. I'm just going to kind of cover it, lightly cover it. We freshly grated that cheddar cheese, That's too. Amazing. Extra sharp cheddar cheese. It's so good. So good. And one more little bit. Okay, so we've got our cheddar. And now we're gonna put green onions. What do I always say, Debbie? Um, Some people know. call them oh, green yeah. <laughs> onions, but they're really scallions. Y'all heard that before. It's from uh, Christmas Dragnet. If you haven't heard Christmas Dragnet, YouTube. Get on YouTube and look it up. Okay, so here is your green onions and they're chopped. Good job, Debbie. And then, last but not least, we're going to add chopped tomatoes. And y'all, in the summertime when the tomatoes are fresh, oh my goodness, mm, makes such so a big difference. Can't wait till then. I know. <laughs> I had to it does that, look you know. good. It does look really good. And if I had no idea there was mayonnaise in it, I probably would be licking my lips. Come on, woman. I'll I'll give it a shot. She's gonna give no it a worries. whirl. We're gonna. That was two it. tomatoes. But let me just tell you, um, and I think that's plenty, don't you? Yes, looks good to me. All right. So it is ready. You can put Wait, it in the in the refrigerator and let it chill a little bit. Let those um, flavors, what's the word? Meld together. Meld, <laughs> meld together. Um, but this is how it looks. Isn't that pretty? We're gonna take a picture for you, take a chunk out oh, of it. Okay. My phone. So, we're gonna take a picture of this so we can post it here. It, you guys it looks know. really good and it's, that, some, that taco seasoning, it smells really yeah, good, smell I can it. smell it. Wish we had it's smell very pretty today. Maybe someday. Okay. Here we go. Yum o. Oh. Can't wait to get my chops around it. Okay. All right. Here we go. Thank you. Random scoopable chips. Get you a tomato in there, Dan. Okay. Oops. My cracker broke. My my chip broke. <laughs> crack. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, that's really okay. good. Two thumbs, Two thumbs up. up. 
I don't taste mm -hmm. the mayonnaise, so. You really don't. <laughs> so, y'all try this, it's easy. Recipe will be underneath the video or somewhere. I can't remember where we're going. Above the it. video. It'll be in, it'll be it'll in the be post. In here. <laughs> so y'all try it. It's really easy and enjoy and Merry Christmas once again. Bye. Bye.